All right, fair go rounders all around the world. I have for you here the Marvel Legends Storm that everybody has been waiting for. The classic Jim Lee Storm. And let me tell you, it's a beaut. Um, it isn't perfect, but it is very nice. So she comes with uh, the lightning effects right here. Comes with two of them. That's pretty much only the side accessory she has. Which uh, Hasbro has been using for all these uh, figures with uh, lightning effects. You know, nothing else to it. Very nice. <clears throat> she has her uh, cape in the form of this uh, texture. Um, which isn't the best way to do it. But I can see the attempt of why they did it. Because everything else is plastic. Um, so this had to be uh, some type of cloth material you can see back there Not bad overall um, gets the job done um, doesn't look ugly it blends in with the figure um, Overall nice articulation You can see here is a little limited But in order to do her poses you could pretty much get her to be up there um some shoulder sleeves here. The usual bending of the knee for a female figure. I'm just glad Storm doesn't wear heels so she could uh, kind of stand up. And that's kind of because she has a big head. The head weighs more than the body. So she already fell on my shelf uh, a couple of times. So you have to be careful for that. What I would have liked is an uh, extra pair of hands for her. Maybe a... Uh, different movements but i can understand that everybody probably wants to do the floating up in the air movement with the lightning on top just like that usual storm um i got two of these figures one to stay mock one to stay uh open displayed and i could tell on every figure the gray shading on the hair is always different so you're always going to get some type of uh different texture also the x symbols the x symbols right here is different on any figure so you might want to look through a couple of storms if you're lucky enough still to get this figure um just to make sure you get a good paint job because on most of them i have seen that the paint job is very off so the x will be to the left to the right and it just doesn't look uh like a good paint job as you know these are mass produced um hasbro mattel all of them they have been having paint issues with these figures uh at 20 dollars, i would hope that they would get their their production better and now even worse that these figures at twenty two ninety nine, um, because of the the trade exchange um but overall i've been wanting this figure uh very beautiful figure of storm finally we get a jim lee storm aside from all these other short hair storms which weren't bad but they weren't uh the classic storm that they we're used to um, the energy effects, the lightning strike effects, very easy to put on, just like every other figure. I have them displayed on her on my shelf. So you could portray the lightning effects, just like that. Overall, not a bad figure at all by any means. And definitely, uh, for me, since I love classic figures, it is the go-to storm figure and if you've been having any uh doubts about this figure i hope my video gets you closer to buying this figure because it is a nice addition to any collection uh especially if you're looking for a classic storm this is definitely the one so there you have it guys and gals the definitive storm figure in anybody's collection